<clears throat> well, good morning. Happy Tuesday to you. Welcome to our daily devotional. This morning, I want to look at a couple of verses in Romans chapter 14, verses 1 through 3. I think if we follow these verses, would stop a lot of dissension in our churches, a lot of gossiping and a lot of clicks and a lot of talking about this group or that group. This is a great uh, couple of verses here that Paul wrote. Uh, Romans 14, 1 through 3 says, Accept the one whose faith is weak, without quarreling over disputable matters. One's person's faith allows them to eat anything, but another whose faith is weak only eats vegetables. The one who eats everything must not treat with contempt the one who does not, and the one who does not eat everything must not judge the one who does for God has accepted them. Man, that, that is a world of wealth and a little bit of scripture. Um, this could go to so many things, and I mean so many things. Uh, <clears throat> one person drinks, not to excess, because the Bible says not to drink in excess, but one person may have a glass of wine with dinner, and another does not. One person likes to raise their hands in worship, another does not. One person thinks we should say the Lord's Prayer, another does not. Um, the list can go on and on. Halloween, celebrating Halloween. Uh, <laughs> so many things in our churches that we do as Christians that don't go against anything in the Bible, but people judge them because they think that that's not what we should be doing. And the bottom line is this. How on earth are we supposed to accomplish unity if we're constantly judging and tearing down our brothers? over what Paul calls disputable matters. I'm not talking about matters that mean something like whether Jesus is the Son of God. Of course Jesus is the Son of God, and the Bible says that. I'm talking about matters that the Bible really doesn't make clear. As Paul says, should we just eat anything or should we just eat vegetables? And there are people out there who believe and are convinced and, and good for them that they only eat vegetables. And that's great. The Bible says we can eat anything, but we're not to judge the person who only eats vegetables. Do you see how that works? Do you see how we can all get along if we decide that we are not going to fight and quarrel over disputable matters? Um, I've seen churches split over the color of the carpet. It's absolutely insane what we want to argue over instead of reaching for unity. See, unity should be embedded in us and that should be the driving force on all the decisions that we make. So churches and people in churches that, that have quarrels and those things, this needs to stop. We need to be unified so that we can spread the gospel of Jesus Christ to the world. And the world wants nothing to do with a church who just argues and quarrels over everything. They'll just walk away. Something to think about today. Hope this helps you a little bit. And uh, we'll see you tomorrow, friends.